Get to Jennifer Williams in just a second. Uh, Jennifer, we've well, that's right. Well, we just talked to Jennifer Williams. I still have Jennifer Williams on my mind. Do you want to get to Jennifer Blum in just a second? Talk but about that. We're going to talk about it. But first, I got to tell you about dental implants because at Bowen Dental Care, if you need dental implants, Bowen Dental Care, he is the expert. Now, look, if you go somewhere else, they're going to shop you all around town. They're going to farm you out. You're going to go to different doctors in different places. And do you know at all those places they have quotas? At Bowen Dental Care, there it's a family-run business. So all of the work is done at their world headquarters on Dunn Road. All the work is done by Dr. Bowen. And there's it's personalized because it's your teeth. And your mouth is different than my mouth. And so it's personalized when you go to Dr. Bowen. I know, shocking, right? That personalized service from a dentist. Who, who would have thought? B-O-A-I-N, Bowen Dental Care. If you're looking for dental implants, he's a great resource to find out more Im- information. And I would highly recommend a second opinion if you've gone somewhere else. Bowen Dental Care, B-O-A-I-N, Bowen Dental Care, or BowenDentalCare.com. Good morning, Jennifer Blum. Morning, McGraw. Morning, Kelly. Good morning. What kind of dog do you have today? This is a Chihuahua Dachshund mix named Brody. He's three months old. Isn't he adorable? Brody. Oh. He's crying the whole time. Well, he's a baby. He is... Truly, he's probably one of the cutest ones we've had. How we, how, how big is this dog going to get? Not very big. 20 yeah. pounds, maybe. Oh, we yeah. have a whole bunch of puppies and kittens at the APA Oh, now. What's, what's going on? It's, it's, it's the season. What, what what was going on nine months ago? Tis the season. <laughs> how, long does it take, how long does it take for a dog to have a baby from the time, you know, from the... From Inception. The, <laughs> the gestation period. <laughs> from the candlelight dinner to birth. How long does that take? How's Mo- Why do you want to know? I was just curious. How's Molly? Mo- Are you worried? No, Mo- Mo- no Molly Molly doesn't. But you don't allow her to. No, she doesn't associate with any of the riffraff in Cottleville. <laughs> and she's fixed, right? She's she's pure, yes. <laughs> she's pure. <laughs> she, <laughs> he doesn't want to think of his daughter as. But, but Molly, doesn't, Molly doesn't think of those things. No, she's. Hitting the streets. She's getting cuter, actually. Oh, how old is she now? She's a little over three. Well, it's so nice to hear you say that. She is getting, she is getting cuter. And, but she's afraid to go downstairs in the basement. Really? What, what's going on in your basement? Um, well, that's where all the dead bodies are. Um, <laughs> so I, I'm downstairs working in the workshop, and she'll stand at the top of the steps and wag her tail and maybe take two or three steps down. And then when she hears the power saw stop, she'll take two or three more steps down, and then she'll, like, wait for me to come. Well, that's why she's afraid. Well, yeah, the maybe sound it's of the that power, power saw. saw. No, she's not, she's, not afraid of, she's not afraid of thunder or lightning. She's not afraid of anything. It could be the saw, though. She's my dog. She's not afraid of woodworking oh, tools. Come on now. <laughs> she's perfect. Uh, all right, so... Um, well, no, are you having a run on dogs? Because you, you guys were awful low on dogs and cats. Well, we were. And because we have such a high adoption rate, we transfer them in from other shelters. So right, right now we have some really great uh, Great Dane lab mixes. And we have Brody here. We're at 1705 South Hanley. We open at 10. So this, is, this, is, this dog's three weeks old? Three months. Three, three months, months old, because that's the time you can start adopting, right? At three months. Yeah, he'll be fixed today. Oh, look at that. And then he'll be face. available tomorrow. I know. He's, he's very so cute. cute. I'm not doing it to you. It's not my fault. <laughs> <laughs> don't don't blame me. believe in spay and neuter to control the pet overpopulation. You problem. guys do that as part of the service, right? Yes. When yeah. you adopt a dog or cat, it's been spayed or neutered and has had most of its shots, and there's a two week health guarantee, and they're ready to go. A two week health guarantee? Uh huh. Oh, which means that... 14-day health guarantee, so if your dog might have kennel cough or something, you bring it back and okay. take care of it, gotcha. which is, you know, pretty common. It's like they... And after two weeks, though, they should be fine anyway. Yes. Gotcha. Okay, yes. good. Um, oh, we have a trivia night coming up. Oh, I yes. Oh. Didn't you tell me you've emceed a whole bunch of a those? A million trivia nights. I've never emceed one before. Art and I are emceeing it. Oh, this will be oh, fun. Oh, back together again. Uh-huh. Yes. And this is like the Beatles coming back together again. Is yeah. it? Yeah. You is guys it will hard be great. to do it? It's extremely hard, especially with Art Holiday. <laughs> <laughs> you anyway, guys will have a blast. The egomaniac Art Holiday? Oh, we're oh selling, my goodness. We're <laughs> selling tables. You just go to apamo.org, and uh, it'll, it'll really Can, can I give you one? Yeah, do, because I've never even been to a One night. suggestion. Please. First of all, when is it, where is it, and how much? It's July 23rd, and all the details are at apamo.org. Okay, good. This dog's getting a little frisky. Yeah, <laughs> he's liking your new earbuds. Yeah, I think he needs to. Okay. We um, also have this book club now for kid. We've we've heard so much from the public about wanting their kids to come in and read to dogs. Hmm. So now you can do it at the APA. It's called oh. the BFF Book Club, Best Furry Friends Book Club. So again, just email me for that. And we even have some free books we're giving to kids, so they can what come in. What kind of books do they read to, read the to dogs? our dogs? War and Peace. Moby Dick. <laughs> the Encyclopedia. James Joyce. <laughs> you know, the usual. 
<laughs> the tender bar. Uh, yeah. The dogs love, love that, that dog. That is a great that book. book. Yeah. That is a great book. I just was at a. I was just at a. Um, Book, uh, book club. They asked me to come and speak at the book club. I remember meeting your cousin many years ago. Yeah. And I, I just loved that book. Um, so. Have you read The Nest? Oh, that is Jennifer. That's another. With really your recommendation, the it was nest? so good. Mm-hmm. The it's, Nest? It's a novel about siblings fighting over a trust fund. Yes. The Nest. Oh. It was very good. Fascinating. Did it just come out? Mm, I don't know. A few Did, months ago. A novel? It, it, it's a novel? It's a novel. Mm, okay. Uh, here's, here's my two pieces of advice for your trivia night no joke you're going to go through 100 questions right fast faster rather than slower you mean talk fast get to the right you're going to read the question and then people are like wait 35 seconds sometimes 35 seconds is too long right mm. so you've got 100 questions if you you know give each question a minute, you'll be there all night. You'll you'll be there all night because then you got breaks and then you have trivia and then you got stretch and you know tri- you know auctioning off stuff. Faster the better. Our events coordinator Kayla Hurley is a badass. Take no prisoners producer. Are you, are you she allowed, will do everything. She's fast. just out of curiosity. Again. Are you allowed to say that word on television? What um, word? I'm not on television. That's right. <laughs> You know, actually, we're thinking about having an adult book club, and I think we should call Ooh. it Book Bitches. Ooh. I and have one of our that. lovely female dogs posing with a book <laughs> and have adult women and yes. wine. And what's the first book? Yes. Fifty Shades of Grey? <laughs> oh, that was so poorly written. Oh. You know, well, we know where your mind is. <laughs> I love that. Let's do Don't it. Do you, like, you think yes. that would offend people to say Book Bitches? Well, we'll find out because you've now said it twice. <laughs> <laughs> it used to offend me when people called dogs that, but that is what a that's, female That's dog the official term. That's a female dog. It offended me greatly, but that's in the animal welfare field. That's what people say. Mm-hmm. That's what they are, yes. Mm. Mm-hmm. But they don't refer to women that way, though. No, of course not. No, they don't. I just well, wanted to so make... so you could bring, maybe the adult women could bring their dogs to yeah. them. They're bitches. female dogs. I got, te- I got, ten, I got <laughs> 10 seconds. The website and find out more about the dog. APAMO.org. The APA opens today at 10 a.m. 1705 South Hanley. We're just down the street. Brody. 858 KTRS. Brody. You've been lied to.